Hello friends, welcome to C Sharp Intermediate to Advanced tutorial. In this sub series, we are going to look at the tool strip uh, control and how to add and toolbar buttons into it. So, first we will look at the toolbar basics, then we will see about this example, then we will continue and start implementing this sample application. So, like a menu strip control, tool strip also a lengthy placeholder control. We already saw the menu strip control. Menu strip control houses menus, one or more menus. Likewise, tool strip also a placeholder, and this placeholder will house one or more toolbar buttons. So, the below picture shows the example uh, tool strip control. If you see this one is the windows uh, form and this one is the toolbar or tool strip so if you see the tool strip spans the entire uh, width of the windows form and this part here this is called a gripper using this gripper you can move the toolbar I mean the tool strip and whatever you saw here is the toolbar buttons and in the buttons here we are seeing only the icons and this one is the separator so toolbar icon tied to menu commands Suppose if we add a menu to this uh, uh, form and we may see file, file is the menu on the menu strip, then we will have file new, file open, file save, file print as menu items. So the same command can be given in a toolbar also so that user can directly click on the particular icon and they can trigger the event say for example to save a particular file using the menu user need to click file then they can click save or when they use the tool strip they can directly go and click on this uh, save button so usually frequently used command will be placed in a toolbar so when you click menu you may see multiple menu options say for example when you click uh, edit menu you may see some 20 or 25 options say for example when you click edit menu you may see 20 or 25 menu commands but in toolbar you may see only three or four of the edit commands that means frequently used commands are placed in the toolbar for easy access so this will ease the user to quickly execute the specific command just by clicking the toolbar button so we already saw this so this is the separator a toolbar or a tool strip can house toolbar buttons and a separator so these are all the toolbar buttons and this is a separator and this one is a separator so the separators are used to group the command and if you see here all file related operations are placed together then there is a separator and you see uh, copy paste options cut copy and paste so that is grouped together then this is a help so one can add the toolbar buttons either side of the toolbar if you see here some toolbar buttons are in the left side and some buttons are in the right side so we can add in both the direction 
So toolbar can be docked on any four edge. Using the quick access menu, uh, we can dock it also from left or uh, so at present you are seeing the tool strip is uh, docked towards the top. You can dock it towards left, right or bottom. But uh, this is the frequently used position. And that's all here in this video. There is no, no demo here. Thank you for watching. Bye.